Yo, yo, yo. Back again, another installment, just copped it. Today we are opening the human made special book. I'm recording off my cell phone so that I can easily upload this um, as soon as I shoot it. So just give you a little bit of background. Human Made is a brand founded by Nigo, the founder of A Bathing Ape. Um, he founded it, I believe, in 2011, if I'm not mistaken. Feel free to go on Google and, you know, do what you got to do. Get the get the facts right. But in the words of the illustrious uh, Bodega Boys, facts don't matter. Um, so, yeah, he founded this brand with Skate Thing, who is the lead designer uh, on Bape. So, doing all the graphic design work. And I ordered this special book, which is essentially a catalog, if I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, a uh, like a lookbook for the upcoming collection. And this cost me 2,350 yen, which plus with in addition to shipping, which was I think 650, it was like 3,000 yen, I believe, something around there, which was approximately thirty dollars, like just under thirty dollars. And like many of the Bathing Ape mooks or uh, their lookbooks, it comes with a special item, which is this canvas tote, which I'm really excited to see and get my hands on, especially considering that uh, similar canvas totes, I'm not sure if like what kind of material they're using, if it's a heavier material than the one that they actually sell in their main line, um, but those retail for, I think, $125. So I was excited to get that as a special item that comes with this lookbook. So. With no further ado, actually, let's take a, a quick detailed look at the front, the top, because if you know Nigo, Nigo pays attention to details, okay? There's no, there's not gonna be any blank sides on this joint. You know what I'm saying? And here's the back here. Human made, everything on shoulder bag. So it does look slightly shorter. Maybe, it, maybe it folds up a bit. Oh no, we're gonna have to see what that is. We're gonna have to see what that is. Let's crack this thing open. And I'm again, I'm recording this on my phone, so I'm saying the quality is, it is what it is at this moment. It's just gonna be easier for me to get this up after the fact. Try and open this without damaging the box. Will it fall out? Nope. Yo, what the fuck? This thing is like, it's burglar proof. Oh, okay. This is the first piece. Who's that? That guy looks familiar right there. Is that Pharrell? Yeah, it probably is. With the Ambaga denim jacket. Nigo got on a, it looks like a souvenir jacket, but got the cool little sailor joint up there. Human made special. So this is the special book? Is this the special book? I don't know, I haven't looked in there yet. But maybe this is the special book. I'll give you all a little preview. You get on his uh, his NMD joints. Wait, what are those? I don't know, I don't know the name. God, for God, God, please forgive me. Let's see, flip through this. Woo, Human Made 2018 Spring Collection. Yeah, that duck right there is fire. Do a quick little flip through. So y'all can get a look at this collection if you're interested. Human Made is a dope brand. Uh, unlike Bape, this brand was really has a focus on vintage workwear and remade vintage goods. In addition to some modern, some modern pieces as well. Yeah, this is fire. Woo! Nigo knows how to do a luck book, I tell you. Yo, if you ever have a chance to uh, Get your hands on the Bape book by Rizzoli. I strongly advise you to. I've got one myself. May have another one in the stash, who knows? But yeah, you should definitely get your hands on that. See all the collections, all the previous collections of Bape that Nigo released, in addition to lookbooks, anecdotes from different designers and friends, colleagues. This is fine. It's a piece you would have seen in a, in a Bape catalog once upon a time ago. Something similar to this. Anybody that really was fucking with Bape, not from its inception in 93, because that'd be a little crazy. Well, 93 or 96, one of the two. But 
not from its inception, but early on, you'll recognize some of these motifs that were part of the main line and not, you know, the overhyped nonsense, even though it was all hyped up at one point. There we go. There's that. I wonder if that's the book. That might be the book. Oh, I wanna, oh I ripped the box. It's a bad hit. How else is it? Okay, here we go. There we go. We got it out. Let's see. This might be the tote. This might be the tote. Ugh. Let's see. Let me cut this open. If that's the book, that's gonna be, that'd be funny, this whole big box. Whoo! Man, first impressions, this canvas, this is not lightweight canvas. It's not light. It feels, it's heavier than uh, some souvenir totes that I've gotten at museums in the past, so I'm happy about that. Let me see if I can zoom in so you can see that. Nice screen printing right there. Quality, 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 quality. Look at that. Branded buttons. This is the shoulder bag. Now, it looked like it extended. Oh, it does, okay. So boom, here we go. I'm gonna unbutton it here. So I guess you could wear it as a shoulder bag like, like, like this. Getting tongue twisted over here. Where it's nice and compact. Or you could unbutton this. It's kind of like an extendable tote bag. Gears for futuristic teenagers. That's a slogan commonly used, human made pieces. Got the heart logo. It's got this front pocket here, in addition to uh, this little pocket where you could hold your phone or keys or something. Extendable shoulder strap. Let me see if I can extend this real quick and show y'all what it looks like in action. So this is what it looks like on me. I'm sorry, I don't know what this looks like, but hopefully you'll be able to see this. Yep, I think you can, I see you off the reflection over on the window there. Boom, this is fire. I like this. This is worth the $30 alone. Not gonna lie. And it's kind of what you're paying for, I suppose, especially considering how lightweight this book is. But the pictures are beautiful. Expect nothing less from Nego. This piece, this is, yeah, that's five flames. That's fire. But yeah, that's it. This sweater is from Stussy. It's one of my favorite pieces from this current season. So if you like it, go see if you can find it and get it. Hopefully you can. If not, you know what I'm saying? I'm sorry, you missed out. But that's it for this installment of Just Copped It. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe, comment, whatever. Thumbs up, all that good stuff. At Venter NY. Follow, 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 follow